opened its doors 75 years ago, and today it opened its doors to the public for the last time. The store that has everything is soon to hold nothing. The White Elephant is a family-owned and family-run business. Previous financial issues were intensified by the coronavirus pandemic, and the store is permanently shutting down. There's really no way to describe how it feels. Because there's no such thing like the White Elephant that I've ever encountered anywhere else. The shock of closing down the family business has set in to 17-year-old Steve Divert. He has been working at the White Elephant while they are getting rid of everything in stock. His grandfather, Richard Conley, is the co-owner. You may think that he would be sad today, but he is feeling positive. Very anxious to start doing things with my grandkids and going out and using some of the stuff I've been selling all these years, the camping gear and the fishing and hunting gear. I see it in boxes, but I haven't ever seen it out of the box. And now he has time to be with all of them. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. But wait, there's more. A hundred and four more grandchildren and great grandchildren, most of which work at the store. I don't think it's really going to change the community with the family. The family's been pretty well knit for a good while, and I think it's going to continue to be that way. They don't want to think of this as the end but more of just closing the door. In downtown Spokane, Morgan Trow, Krem 2 News.